Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to give you top secret places to visit when you're staying in Bar Harbor, close to Bar Harbor, visiting Acadia National Park, and some ideas you probably never even thought of. Please make sure you like and subscribe to the channel, and let's get right into it. As you can see from this map, a lot of the tips I'm going to give you in this video are very close to Bar Harbor, most of them within an hour, some even closer. Also, when you get outside of Bar Harbor or Acadia National Park, if you like lighthouses, there's so many outside of those areas. Here in this drone footage, you're going to see Prospect Harbor Point Lighthouse. Uh, there's Winter Harbor Lighthouse. There's so many. So get out and explore, you know, try different areas besides the local hangout of Bar Harbor. You're going to see in this video many different other activities to enjoy. Here we are, Scudic District of Acadia National Park. Okay, here is a fact about Acadia National Park that most people don't even know about. There's a part of Acadia National Park that's on the mainland. It's called Scudic Point Peninsula. It has a loop just like Acadia National Park does, and there's so much to do there and see. You have to make sure you check out the Scudic Point Loop. It's literally four miles from Bar Harbor, so unless you take the ferry, you got to kind of drive around, and that four mile as the crow flies, will take about 45 minute drive if you decide to drive there. Winter Harbor Lighthouse. It's on an island, you can only get there by boat. But you can see it on the Scudic Loop. If you just pull off to the side of the road. Here you can see this tide going out and it is moving. And probably about another hour, you'll be able to walk straight across to that island. It's amazing how far this tide goes in and out. Beautiful, beautiful park here at Acadia Scudic Point. Hiking trails around here. If you like walking or hiking, it's absolutely beautiful. And make sure you take these trails that go off of Scudic Point, and you'll wind up at an amazing sight every single time. These rock formations just simply amazing. Such a beautiful place. The waves are just crashing along here. I don't know if you can hear them, but depending on the time of day, it's different every time you come here. It's just beautiful. If you got a camera, photography, this is definitely one of the highlights. Scudic Point in Acadia, which is the only point that is on the mainland. Be sure to check it out. This is a must stop, the Pickled Wrinkle. It's a local favorite, it's in Birch Harbor. They got the best burgers, tater tots, and make sure you don't miss the cheese curds. They're unbelievable also. And when you're done at the Pickled Wrinkle, make sure you go next door. There's an ice cream shop that is amazing. 
Welcome to Tracy's Clam and Lobster Rolls. This is a little lobster shack called Tracy's. The lobster rolls are supposed to be pretty good. We're gonna try that. We're gonna try their seafood platter for two. And we're gonna let you know how it is. All right, here we are. We're gonna try these lobster rolls. We'll let you know how they are. That's pretty darn good. Go ahead. Well, you ate all the lobster off that end. <laughs> They're, good. they're really good. Tracy's, try it out. Every town in Maine's got a lobster place right along the road. You've got to stop at a lobster place. They got these roadside stands where they're boiling these suckers. And if you could smell it right now, oh my gosh. It's looking good and it smells more good. And all these lobster pots, they're steaming them right here, throwing the wood in. It's awesome. Le Moyne State Park. It's beautiful here. A little rocky beach. Good quick stop right off the uh, path going to Acadia or Bar Harbor. Gorgeous. Check out this overhead shot of Goldsboro, which is where we stayed outside of Bar Harbor. You're around a lot of things to do, as you can see from the map I showed you before, but it is a great place to stay. I can give you some tips on Airbnbs, the one that we stayed at. Excellent. Okay, I can't state this one enough. If you're staying outside of Bar Harbor or if you're in Bar Harbor and you want to go see different sites over where the... Uh, Scudic Point Peninsula is the ferry that's in Winter Harbor. It goes back and forth a couple times a day from Bar Harbor to Winter Harbor. It's a 20-minute ride. Drops you off right downtown Bar Harbor if you're going from Winter Harbor to Bar Harbor. But again, it's a great ferry ride. We saw eagles. Uh, the rock cliffs are amazing. Make sure you check it out. All right, if you're close to Winter Haven in this area, every Tuesday they have their farmer's market. Uh, nothing spectacular or big, but obviously it's where people want to come to get their fresh vegetables. This is the main street in Winter Harbor. A couple cool little shops, little restaurants, nothing fancy, but you definitely have to go to the 5 and 10. Welcome to the 5 and 10 in Winter Harbor. If you've never been in one, it's got everything. Tidal Falls is part of Frenchman's Bay, and as you can see, it is beautiful. All right, this is a must-see. It's called Tidal Falls, and the currents here switch at low tide. So you want to come two hours before or two hours after, and you will see the water, how it is flowing, will re reverse 
direction. All right, we're two hours before low tide. In another two hours, this thing should be reversing direction. We will see. Look at all these muscles here at Tidal Falls. They're little baby muscles. You can see here, this is, has a great picnic area here. People come into the evening to watch the falls reverse. It's getting dark. I'm hoping we can see this reversal. All right, it got a little dark on us in uh, Tidal Falls, but you can see these before and after shots where the water flowed upward one way and then down the other way. It's a really cool sight. Don't miss it. Welcome to the Lobstore. Live lobsters for sale. Pretty good price, best I've seen. All right, we're at the Lobstore. We're getting lobsters for the big cookout tonight. If I be honest, loving you the hardest thing to do, so I keep to myself. I feel like I'm falling, eating out of consciousness. Yeah. Now we started. Look at this lobster and corn. Straight from the ocean. Alright, this is day two of our lobster bake at the lobster store. We got these lobsters simply amazing and we're gonna dig in here